So this is episode 2 of top 5 forge maps. I want to apologize in advance to the forge creators at the moment of recording I did not have your guys names for the creators on certain maps. But I have fixed that. You shout out all these guys all links for their maps will be in the description. So let's hop into it. So for top 5 Halo Infinite maps this episode we are starting off number 5 with a classic an absolute classic. This is Modern Warfare's 2019 Ur Call of Duty 4 shipment remade in Halo Infinite Forge. Alright, so I'm in Forge here and this is the map. This is shipment from MW 2019. So let's hop in here and play a test it and just run around. Right, this is day 2 of Forge being released and this guy had this uploaded on the first day, which is very impressive. Very, very impressive. So could you imagine it with a little bit more detail and uh, how good he could actually do on this with a little bit more time. So he has actually nailed this shipment map. A small few changes here as this crate is here. I'm pretty sure this crate isn't here in the 2019 one and you can actually go straight through. I could be wrong. I think he's done that on this opposite side as well. Yeah, he's blocked this side as well. I know in MW 2019 you can come through these either crates. So all links for these maps will be linked in the description. Very excited to try out some 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 free for all on this map. Definitely be whipping out the sniper for that one. So for map number four, we have Argonaut B base map, which is a snow map in Halo Infinite. It is a BTB map. I did indeed play a lot of customs on this map on day one, and I have to say it was incredibly fun. We've got the Catalyst Brew Chopper added in here, we've got a lot of grav lifts, and we've got a lot of open space to play around with. This map felt like a true BTB map, it felt how BTB should feel. With open spaces and all the vehicles that were already on the map, it was definitely a fun time. And we have this super long, massive grav lift there, which is very satisfying to go up. You can actually make it the full way up without hitting your head on that thing. Honestly, I had so much fun on this BTB map. I would like to see it added into rotation. So we have all kind of forerunner architect over this side, which is really, really good. Really well designed. This map was also released day one of Forge. Now we have all this open space at the back. We've got a sniper spawn over here and there's also a sniper spawn on the complete other side of the map as well. So the only thing this map is kind of missing is a couple of teleporters. I'm pretty sure the creator will add these in. Link for this map will be in the description. So on to map number three, we have the Repulse Football Desert map, which is actually named the Repulse Soccer Desert. So this one is extremely fun. We did post a small bit of gameplay on this one already. With a full lobby, this map can get very, very hectic, but is it is extremely fun. Cool little feature he's added in here is when you score a goal, a little sentinel comes in and drops off the football again. Definitely had the most fun on this one yesterday. Definitely the most chaotic, but one of the funnest custom games I've played so far. Yeah. For map number two, we have Haven recreated in Halo Infinite. So this remake is absolutely spot on. It's 10 out of 10 in my opinion. This is the Halo 4 remake of Haven. This is definitely one of the better maps from Halo 4. I definitely wasn't a big enjoyer of Halo 4, but this map was, it's one map that I always remember and I always did enjoy on that game. And this is a really, really solid remake of it. Got the grav lift over there. It's got everything down to a T in my opinion. Let's have a look at the lower deck and see how good he's done the job on it. Definitely looking forward to trying out some SWAT or some Slayer on this map later on. So for map number one we have Eternity which is the moon map. This map was showcased by 343 already but this definitely takes number one spot this week as this map is 
just absolutely incredible. I, I really don't understand how 343 have not added this into matchmaking yet. I just just look at it. Just just take a look at it like it's the aesthetic is 10 out of 10. It's so well done. Absolutely incredible work done here. Still yet to actually play a custom game on this, but I have um, I have seen people play on it. It, it does look it does look pretty fun. But yeah, what a what a great job done here by this guy. Who whoever has made this, I'm gonna link once again. All links for these maps will be in the description. And I'm sorry to all the creators who created these maps. I can't find your names right now. My game be bugging. She be bugging. But um, once I find your names, I will link them all in the comment section. But yeah, this this is absolutely insane. That's top five maps for episode number two, boys. Make sure you go check out all these maps. They are all insanely fun and really well put together that's all for now boys have a great day